Good morning. Today is August 30th, 2022. And as usual, I'm going to do some analysis to it. However, before I do that, I'm going to put in some puzzles over here in uh, the board. And I will let you try to guess my move. Feel free to pause the video and think about it. And then we'll go to the game and I'll show you how the game plays after that during the game. Ready? This is the first move. Uh, this one right here. Black has just moved uh, his bishop to the h3 square. What is the best move? All right, so that's one, and this is the second move, the second, second position right here. Black has just moved the queen from h4 square to g5 square. What is your best move? And that's it, so uh, this is the last one. Black has just moved the king from d7 to e6. What is the best move? All right. So those are the three things, and hopefully you can solve that problems at the time uh, just now. So let's go to the game really quick. And this is a standard King Indian opening move. Uh, this is challenging the bishop over here. Usually the bishop would go over there. And then I'll just let it hang around. Knight would go here, pawn go here, and queen go here. That's the standard format uh, for this game right here. I'm going to turn on the annotation right here. Right, so uh, next move right here. So text that, text that, and that's the position right here, earlier. So there's a little trick to it. The first one over here is you take that, bishop of course, queen takes one, and then that certain the queen. So queen cannot go here or here or here. So the queen goes here, right there. So that's the s s square and that takes pawns. And if queen takes knight, rook takes knight, king takes knight. And what has just lost a uh, right to castle over here. And black is in trouble. If, however, black does something else uh, like uh, like maybe do this net text rook and that's about it so so that I should have done that I did not do that this is what I did so just totally forget about that well, pretty standard here and this is a danger right here because you can go here so what I need to do is I need to do that and stop that one over there. Now black can move the pawn here and to threaten this one but right now that covers that square or that right there so I don't have to worry about it so I should have done the pawn push but I push that pawn over there and black is attacking I should have done something I totally ignore that and basically I miscalculated the speed in which I can attack black position versus the speed which black can attack white position. So I miscalculated. Basically that's what I did. And that's a very strong move. And if you look at the evaluation here, that's uh, minus 5 right here. So black has a very strong move over here. 
and it's up to me to basically defend it however I can. Next move. Take that one, take that one, and there's slightly different ways to defend this, to deal with this pawn. I can move the king here, I can move the queen here, I can move the rook there, and of course I move the rook there. And that's how that's this one of the recommendation for the computer. So let's go. And the computer suggested this move. I didn't move that way. So next move. And text. And this turns out to be a mistake. Uh, generally speaking, black is attacking. What I need to do? I need to trade pieces so black will run out of pieces now uh, taking it with the knight as I did is not forceful enough what I should have done is taking it with the queen right here and then the queen will have to choose uh, either going somewhere or take the queen but and if it's a trade of queen then then the position will become equal so I should have done that I should have taken it with the queen Next move. And now I'm attacking the queen. And this is the second position that I showed you earlier. Queen takes knight. And then rook takes knight. And I could have done, again, I could have done it uh, trading with the queen. Let's see if that's good. Mm about equal uh, 3.7 so uh, about equal so anyway I like to shift the queen yet because I'm keep thinking maybe I should do this and then followed by that so I keep thinking that that's why I'm saving the queen next move and that's opening the pawn shield front of the king and it this turns out to be not too well done and there's not enough uh, force over there I should have have another piece somewhere over here to support this pawn so just run out of pieces now this thing is is open already usually that's a good thing but in this case I have the pawn here which I need to push it over here in order to make the attack like I said this pawn needs support over here now I do not do this because if pawn takes that pawn pawn takes that pawn and suddenly the rook is bedding down on the king so that's not good for me next move and finally I exchange the queen over here and I'm trading the knight the king is forced to do that basically and that's the position last position which basically tells you what to do over here the king has just moved uh, from d7 to e6 and what do you supposed to do uh, this one says g rook to g7 right there which of course is what I did and it's very strong because it it's called picks on the seventh basically and uh, you can just go do anything you want usually the king here is somewhere on the back rank over here but obviously that's on the sixth rank so that's a very interesting position all right next move trying to save the knight now there are different uh, possibilities over here uh, you can push the pawn here I choose not to do that I choose just take the pawn there cast the pawn uh, possibility would be to come here and attack there attack the knight there so uh, the knight would be trapped over there because cannot go to these squares right here so that that's the possibilities next move 
and there you go that's made and really black has no good uh, reply for this thing there's no good answer black is totally lost on this one you can see by the evaluation here 11 that's basically this pawn over here is going to be promoted regardless what black does you may treat the uh, immediate upon with the uh, rook in some variations but otherwise that's it the pawn will get promoted and white will win so thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow